what is up YouTube uh, Titan gaming here so what you guys want to do today if you're watching this video is you want to get free music on iTunes through your phone for free you don't want to pay for the music um, it's a very simple process basically what you're gonna want to do is you want to plug in your phone to your computer and open up iTunes um, if you, you when you want to get this free music uh, the next step you have to do is you have to open your Google Chrome up and go head over to YouTube and then you have to type in for the next tab you're gonna go ahead and type in YouTube to mp3 converter I'll send a link for this converter in the description below it's a very simple converter put in the URL hit convert video and then download so let's say you want a song uh, okay so once you have a song chosen um, what you're gonna wanna do is you, you're gonna wanna type that song in so How about this song? It's a pretty old song. Uh, what you don't want to do instead of getting to the official video, if there is one, is you want to type in audio because the official video sometimes has uh, extra words or it takes a bit longer than the actual song. Um, so let's go ahead and hit this one. What you don't want to do is you want to go type into that URL and then type into that converter, and then you're gonna hit download. And it will take like 20 seconds, but while that's downloading, you're gonna want to type in uh, the same song. And what you're going to want is you're going to want this information over here. So once you have this song downloaded, you're going to want to go ahead and add the song to the library from where you downloaded it. Uh, the file name, what's that? There we go. And it's going to add it here as one song and an, um, and as its album. What you're going to want to do is you're going to highlight the song and hit get info. And then here is all the information that you're going to take all of this and put it in here. You don't really need to fill that. You can fill all this out if you want to be specific, like the track number from the albums and everything. But I'm going to just go ahead and make this simple. I'm going to make the artist Coldplay. I'm going to remove all the unnecessary song name. The album will be Ghost Stories. Now, um, I already have some of this song, so it automatically... Uh, has an album already set to it I can click on if you don't have already an album if you already don't have an album for that song you can make an it'll set that as a new one or you can go ahead and hit uh, the one that the one that you already have uh, then the year and then what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna go ahead and artwork and add artwork I already have this go ahead and add that artwork and hit OK now what this is gonna do is it already added it into uh, here in this ghost stories album for example see it's, there it is always in my head with the other songs now if this was one song and it, it, it was its own album for example like faded it's it, it makes a new album but like it automatically does that it doesn't add it to another album because as long as it when you hit the edit uh, get info if as long as the albums the same it'll put it in the same album otherwise uh, the album and the um and the artist if they're both the same then they'll put them in the same album so keep that in mind if you are confused on why they're different so you need to make sure that the spaces and you don't add an extra period add an, ex add an extra period or anything uh thank you uh, for watching my video i hope this video helped you get new music on your iphone and if it did please drop that like uh comment if you have any issues i'll try to help you thanks for watching and signing out